Good morning, Sam. Blood collection complete. Thank you for your generosity. in our line of EX grenades. I give you the number two. As you may have surmised, this model was produced with various extracts refined from your fecal matter. We suspect that your regular consumption of cryptobionts has led you to excrete certain compounds that may prove especially effective against BTs. If you would like us to produce more, you need only furnish us with the requisite raw materials via your private room's toilet. I look forward to your feedback. Second, all this is over. I'm going to take you wherever you want to go. Detected. All weapons will be locked until departure. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges.
have a pleasant journey. chosen to take mommy's place. Well, that won't wash. She's not cut out for politics, is she? Oh, but don't worry. I'll find her. And I'll keep her real safe. <laughs> you see, I've come to understand the truth of the Death Stranding. So much you people don't know. The girl, for instance. She's not like you or me. Dooms ain't her thing. And she's more into destruction on a worldwide scale. An extinction entity. Oh, it's so hard to form connections when you can't shake hands. Fortunately, I've got a good connection to the other side. Now you, you're no bridge. To me, I'm bound to all of it. This world, that world, and our sweet little angel of death. contact with a civilian would be enough. We can't let that happen. You've got to deal with that BT right now.
Incredible. Simply incredible. For the first time in history, a human being has defeated a BT. Were you not a repatriate, I doubt it would have been possible. Not only does contact with your fluids pose no risk of trigger and avoid out, but in much the same way as your car is rejected by the beach, your blood can be used to expel BTs from our world and return them to the other side. You've given us hope, Sam. Perhaps we may yet be saved. Be proud, my friend. Emily's still waiting for you in the west. Head to your boat. It's ready. Get those supplies to Lake Knot City. We're just getting started. Gonna catch a ride on that boat, Sam? Before you do, be aware that you'll have to leave behind any cargo you haven't gotten around to delivering. It'd be a shame to abandon something important, though, especially if you were close to finishing a run. My advice, put that stuff in your private locker in Port Knot City. Or, if you're feeling responsible, you could just delay your boat trip until you've tied up loose ends. It's your call.
snack? You came through then. I don't break that easy. Name notwithstanding. You saw that asshole too, right? Higgs. He's the leader of a separatist group. Seemed to me like he was controlling that BT. That's a level seven for you. Higher, maybe. Seems like you know a lot about him. Used to work together. Guess you could say we had a contract. You did business with terrorists? Whoever pays, huh? He wasn't like that back then. So what's your angle? You want to save the world or you want to fuck it all up like him? I wish I... I just wish things were different, all right? Here's all right. Don't worry, she still floats. Come on. We're the only cargo left. We should get there tomorrow. I told you before, Sam. The past just won't let go. Listen, I have something to ask of you. It has to do with that asshole, Higgs. Do you remember? It's almost time to go, Sam. I 
had no idea until you told me. No idea that I was alive. Living is no different from being dead if you're all alone. Poor woman. I don't want to go home. I don't want to go home. <laughs> away. I'll always be with you. Did you forget how to go home? Come on. I'll take you halfway. And then you can do the rest by yourself. Better now? I'll be waiting for you on the beach. Come and find me. We used to play together a lot in this place. You brought me here. I couldn't make the trip on my own. So long as you have a body to return to, you can't come and go as you please. So you can't just come back east through here? Not until you make us whole again, Sam. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. Come and find me. I don't know how you sleep. Need to pick me up? <sighs> Welcome to Light Knot City. What? Nothing. Let's go. Cargoes from Port Knot City, bound for Lake Knot. I'll leave these up to you. The dispatch terminal is up ahead. In the meantime, I've got some business to attend to. Later, alligator. God 
damn it. Sorry for the hassle. Can't be too careful these days. Oh, we heard you were carrying a Cupid. That right? You're clear to link us up. sharing makes everyone safer, I'm all for it. You can bet I'm not the only one here who feels that way. I suppose it was better when Bridges One first came this way. At least I don't remember terrorists and BTs making our lives difficult back then. Well, be careful out there. The world's not what it used to be. And thank you. Finally made it past Ground Zero, Sam. Congratulations. And thank you. It'll only get harder from here, though. When we first came through, it was different. Peaceful. The three cities out there, Lake, Middle, and South Knot, were all on board with our plans for reconstruction. Fragile Express was contracted by all three and kept supplies moving and people connected. But that all changed a year ago, when the Separatists carried out their attacks. One took out Middle Knot City. They detonated nukes from the old days. Half of South North City went up in the other. Casualties were devastating. Bridges doesn't have the resources to link up the remaining cities on its own. We need to secure the support of everyone, even those who want nothing to do with the UCA. Impossible as that may seem. The situation has changed dramatically since Bridges One first went west. The destruction of Middle Nod in particular forced us to adapt a new strategy. It's like Amelie said, 
We don't have the time or resources to construct another knock on that scale. That's why we've taken to cutting deals with preppers and the like. Our only recourse is to utilize their shelters to bolster the strength of the network. It takes a special kind of person to live out here on their own. The kind that'll tell us to fuck off if we ask them to join the UCA. Oh, we know. No one's expecting them to say yes up front. But even if they don't like dealing with most people, they got on okay with Fragile Express. Don't tell me. You want us to use her credentials to get in good with them? Bingo. She's agreed to it, too. And in exchange, she gets... Nothing, really. A chance to get back at Higgs, I suppose? I can't blame her for warning one. He took everything from her and then some. Time heals some wounds, but... not hers. The work ahead won't be simple or easy, but... it needs doing. Get some rest for now. We'll talk more later. For me? It's called a keeper. It means not in old words. You can also use it to count stuff. I had a knot when I make a friend. Okay. Then how about I add another knot every time I see you? This must be very important to you if you were able to bring it here. Very special. It is special. I made it for you. I'll treasure it, Sam. 